Could you show me the road to Coolwestar Tea? You'll have to come over nearer to me. I'm a bit deaf. I'm looking for the road to Coolwestar Tea. You see that hill over there? Coolwestar Tea is on the far side of that hill. And who might you be looking for this? A farmer by the name of Jack Dunn. I know, know him well. Is he a big farm of land? He's a big farm of land. And what are you going there for? I'm looking for a job as a servant girl. I've come from West Kerry. Ah, he is serving girls every day of the week. They're coming and going like the time of day. He's a hard man to work for. I saw an ad in the paper and I said I, I'd come looking for a job. Oh, I don't know. Are you married? No, I'm not married. But I'm why looking for a man with a good bit of land. Ah, you'll have to go down to Jack Dunn or so. Would he be a young man? He's not a young man. He's in his eighties. And he's crippled with hard rays and he's a mean man to work for. But sure, I'll have to get a job. The work is very scarce back in West Kerry. Oh, be garden, you'll have to go down there or so. i better be on my way so. Go on down that poor in or so. And I'm going up this poor in to see a friend of mine. Good day, sir, and thank you. Good day. Do you want to lift out here, village? Well, I'm going as far as Cool West. Do you know Jack Dunn in Cool West? I know Jack Dunn well. I'm, I'm passing that way. Okay. Well, to you. Thank you, Father.
dieren hoch und wir kahlen es auf. John. I am indeed. I'm Neil Murphy. I'm from West Kerry. I wrote you a letter last week telling you I was calling to you as you were looking for a servant girl. You had a notice in the Kerry man. Oh, I got your letter. Come on in and sit down. Would you ever close the door? Have you a bad leg? Oh, it is the bones, girl. The doctors have a fancy name for it. Ars... Arthritis. Arthritis, you mean? There's a lot of that back wished. I suppose to the cold and the dampness. Around the hills. Much like here. Through Faro, girl. Through Faro. Come on up and sit down near the fire. I see by your letter that you have worked with farmers with this past few years back in West Kerry. I did so and the work was very hard back there, Jack. And then God knows, Neil, you'll get nothing soft around here if that's what you're after. You'll be up in the morning at seven, put down the fire, milk the cows, feed the chickens, and tackle that for the cranberry. You'll have to wash, cook, and so You'll get three meals a day, and you'll have your own room. I pay five guineas a year, and the door will have to be locked at nine o'clock, and the lantern put out after we say the rosary. Well, what do you say to all that? I will take the job, as I'm a long way from home now, and the work is very scarce back in West Kerry. Have a bite, Jack. It would be very handy to go to the village. No, I have not. And there will no bike come inside this door as long as I live. Why? What's wrong with having a bike? The last girl that worked here fell off the bike and broke her hand and broke the bike as well. It cost me a half a crown to fix it. She didn't work for three weeks. And I gave her the road when she looked for money to fix it. If you want to go to the village, you can walk or carry us and care. Right, Jack, you're the boss, I suppose. I am indeed, and that's the way it will be. I better unpack. Your room is up there. Look, hand me over that candle there, and I light it for you. I listen, girl, mind and don't burn anything which is above there. Well, Jack, 
Whatever about you, I'll have my drop. Yourself and your man just five guineas a year. You might have more than your match yet in Nell from the West. Milk there on the table for all. Thanks, Jack. I'm starving. I got the train from Dingle Tabby Field, and I got a lift from a priest in a podium top chair here. I'm very tired now. Neil, when you're finished there, would you ever look, put a stitch there in my old draw? Jack, they're fit to be dumped. There won't be one bob spinning clothes inside this door until the doors are warm. Look, there's a box up there in the cave and you'll get a spool of thread. Right, Jack. Tell me, did you stay long in the last place for a word? I did, Jack. I spent three long years. Oh, I see you. Were you ever married, Jack? No, I was not. You don't know what you're missing. How do you know? Were you there yourself? No, but I used to listen to my friends, my married friends, back in the West. Oh, I see you. I intend to lose that temple that's belonged to my mother. Right, Jack. Jack, is it alright to call you Jack? Oh, indeed it is. You can call me Jack. Should I suppose that you call me a lock horse? I'm supposed to be a mean, hard working man, but I have seen nothing all my life, only hard work and hard times, girl. No, Jack. That's done. By God, Neil. But you made a good job of it. Oh, plenty of practice, Jack. By God, you're a good hand at the needle. Indeed I am.
How long have you the arthritis, Jack? Here I have it a good number of years, Neil. I was all right while Mossy the Quack was alive, but when Mossy died, I'm crippled altogether. My friend Mary O'Connor coaxed me to go to the new doctor in Abbey Fail. He examined me, and he said the right leg wasn't too bad, but the left leg was a hopeless case altogether. And I asked him if I saw, and he said to me he thought it was old age, and that he could do nothing for it. But sure I told him, wasn't the other leg the same age as it? He did nothing for me, Neil, and if you don't mind, he wanted to get paid for it. And that's the last time I ever went near a doctor, and that's I never will as long as I live. Neil, it is time to go to bed. We better kneel down and say the rosary. Down on the flags, Neil. Every girl that came here said the rosary in the flags. Right, I take your flowers for my knees. Don't touch them, Neil. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Father of heaven and earth. Get up, tis after seven o'clock. Nail, nail, you must put down the fire and milk the cows and tattle off the cranberry. Nail, nail, God bless you, nail, you wish carry bitch to be inside.
God bless you if I don't just don't build a stall instead of milking cows out in the open. No. Well, we're ready. Come on. Come on. God bless you, Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on.
That's the milk for the house. In the name of God, Niel, what kept you at this hour of the morning? Look at the time of the day it is. What kept me? That ass. Running around the field after him. And I couldn't catch him. There's nothing wrong with that ass. And the other girl had no trouble with that ass. What did you do to him? Well, I did nothing. I did nothing to him. He's running around the field and I couldn't catch him. We'll have to get rid of him. Get rid of him? What are you talking about? I'll get rid of you first. How do we ever get rid of that ass? No other means of transport? What do you think, woman? Right, There's sir. the book with the cream, right? When God made time, he made plenty for some. But not half enough for you, sir. There's the book for the cranberry. And don't forget to tie the tank nail. Jack is another stupid ass. My name is Jim O'Brien. I live up the road and I go to the bog. What am I going to do now? Jack up. told me to tie the, the, the tank and I didn't do it. I should have done it. He told me to tie it. Now I've spilled some of the milk. What am I going to do? He'll have my life. He won't. He won't. He won't. Calm down. Calm down. Settle down. Settle. Settle. settle the up. the yeah. ass and, the, and Jack, they have been so annoyed. Stop. 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 We'll think of something now. Settle down. Settle down. You don't think it's time for the family now yet. No. Settle down. No. What am I saying now? Look. Look, there's a well down over here, look. I'm going to try a small drop of water into it. Come on, do the same amount of gallons in the book and Jack won't know the difference. And look, what that do? Twill, twill. I worked with Jack before we fell out. I know exactly what he has gone to the family. 
Why don't you shoot? Sure. Hey, do a kettle. It's looking fine. Grab all tank now. Look, and we'll, we'll, we'll mark it on down. Come on. No, no, we must have a little bit low. One bit wiser. You're sure. I'm positive you won't be one bit wiser. There mightn't be any test in either today, you know. One second now, one second now. I'd say we're above the level, have you? One more, maybe, just to be in the safe set. Sure. An increase is better than a decrease. I need a request to the poor. I'm Nell Murphy. I'm from West Kerry. This is my first day with Jack Dunn. Did you come out the way from West Kerry? I did indeed. Right, guys. I want to finish up with Jack Dunn. Right. Well, sure. That's goes. That's the way it goes. That's the way it goes. Well, Jim, you're a godsend. Do you think nothing of it, girl? I do it for anyone. Think nothing at all of it. Think nothing at all of it. Hey, you better be on your way to the Kremlin now. To come here. Then you hope you'll meet me this evening, is that? Because I'd love to find out how you got on. The tank and the meat killings. I could go to the well for a bucket of water. But I won't be able to stay long. Yeah. Well, just for going to the well, I'll meet you at Turin Bridge. Seven o'clock. Right, so... Is that all right? That's fine, Jim. Seven o'clock. Hey, I must go out to the bog. I'm I better be off to the Kremlin. I'll see you, Jim. All right, Carol. Good Thanks, luck. Jim. Good luck. Good luck. Broken from 
God be with the deaf, and I was able to do it myself, and have no other around. Good help is had to come by, Jack. No one knows it better than I do, Mary. Well, I better be going now, Jack, before she comes from the Kramer. <clears throat> but, Jack, what brought me all together is the land. We do consider letting us the land. We are bound in one another, and we are friends all our life. And it would be very convenient for us, no more servant girls to be breaking our heart. By God, Mary, I never thought of letting the land. I had it in my head all right that I would sell it and get out of trouble altogether. My heart is broken with all them serving girls, and this one is no better than the lash ones. In fact, she is even worse. And Jack, did you say you'd sell the land? Well, Patchine and myself never thought we'd consider selling it. But we're bound in one another, and we're neighbours all our life, Jack. And I take good care of old Jack if we sold us for land. Sure, and we corn together for years and years. Since our father's time we're corn. And we would never again want for anything, Jack. I take good care of old Jack in our old age. I'll be going now, Jack, before the new girl comes home from the Kramer. And Jack, what we discuss need no go further than that hit there now. I'll talk to Petrine about it and I'll be back. And mind yourself now, Jack. front of me and I had to wait my turn and in spite of all the toll I wasn't the last. And if you got your pearl in your food be the first. Look at all the work that has to be done. The beds have to be made. The spuds wash for the dinner. And look at all the dates. Give me that cranberry book. Glory be to God. I'm tell you up again in the milk today. Well, Nell, you must be a great milker altogether. That's the first time now that I can remember that I'm up a gallon of milk like that. The rest of the girls mustn't be able to milk them cows at all. Well, you know, Fat, you're a great milker. I'm a great milker, all right. I got Nell, but you would. You're a good milker. Up a gallon today. God knows, Neil, you're able to milk cows, and you know that you could be a great worker altogether. And then, Neil, would I give you a chance? And I'd say, Neil, you could do with a drop of tea, you know, after coming home. Glory be to God. Well, glory be to God. My garden, Neil, you seem to be a good baker. Oh, I'm well used to it, Jack. My mother was a great baker. I suppose we're at it a long time. I am indeed. Did you start young at it? I said I was only about ten.
nagamit ba ta sa fine brigade? We won't be hungry today. Neil, don't forget to put the cover on them. I can't stay long. I have a bucket of water at the well, and I'll be back to Jack soon. He'll suspect something. But how do we get on this morning with him? Oh, great. When I gave him the cream book, you should see his face. It lit up. I never saw anything like it. Jesus, Nelly, now what? He'll fall for it. Like Christ, now what? He'll fall for it. Oh, Jesus, he is. I never saw any man to smile like that before. And tell no, he'll fall for it. Nell, is there any hope we'll see me tomorrow night? I'd love to, Jim, but... It would be impossible. Jack is so exact, you know, and the rosary is set at nine o'clock. And he locks up then after that. I wouldn't be able to. Hey, you might be able to snake out the window after nine o'clock and then meet up over the top of the road. Maybe I could chance it. Ah, you will. Go on. Go on. Say you will. Go on. I'll try. I will. I will. Good job. I will, Jim. Good job. I'll see you tomorrow night, Jim. Postman, a parcel for you, Jack. Are you there? Oh, 
Well, God kitten just in you get one of them. And then you was down the village. No, not nothing that all is quiet. I got you a bit chilly. I hit away for the fire. Yeah. Okay. Good look and take. New York. Ah, Rosemary. Dear Jack. Just a note. Hoping you are well. I am sending you all bits and pieces of clothes. They might come in useful. I'll be seeing you shortly. All the best, Jack, from your godchild, Rose Mary. Well, after all those years. Bed yet, Nell. I'm saying my prayers. Nell, wouldn't you go to bed so that you'll be able to get up early in the morning? I'm saying a prayer for you, Jack. God bless you, Nell. Good night, Jack. Well, I get out this window and Jim is waiting for me. Oh, Jim, is waiting for me. Oh, I never fit out the window. Oh, God. Oh, I open this window. Oh, God, Jimmy. Oh, I have my life. I'm too busy. Oh, God. What can I do? What can I do? I'll have to go over the door. Yeah, my God, it's Kate and Hood. She should have been here long ago. She can't be here, my name's Lloyd. Is that who, Nell? Well, Jesus, it is, Jim. Why? Were you expecting someone else? No, 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 no. But it was getting late now. I was getting worried about you. But sure, I couldn't open the blasted window and I had to go out the door. I had to wait for Jack to go to sleep and creep out the door. Well, it's all right, it's all right. I'm not here now and that the main thing. Hey, it is a bit cold. No chill, there's no, there's no chill in it. There's a shady spot down here. Look, we, 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 we'll sit down there for a while and we'll have an old chat. I'll throw my old bike against the ditch. Isn't the bike handy, Jim? I'd oh. love to have a bike, Jim. Would you? I would. To be handy to go to the village. You know what? Isn't that a bike? Bike below in the shed. Belonged to my poor mother, God rest her. Yes, no. sir. Oh, wheels a bit flat, but I could fix them. No, I'll drop the while, let's get it going. I'll bring it up to have it fixed up. Oh, Jim, and you're great. You're not at all. Think nothing of it, yellow. Think nothing. Look, I'll throw this old bike into the ditch here, look, and, and we can sit down. I hope Jack won't say anything about it. Hurry him off to hell. What's he to say about it? I don't like him, you have a bike. You should. You have to have some way of getting around. Huh? He says mm -hmm. all the walking. Oh, Jim. Huh? No, there, look, there. Just what there, there. Ah! I ain't no, Nell. I've been doing a bit of thinking about this for the past few days. And if we could see it my way, if myself and myself could get together, even husband and wife, and we we'll look after Jack's place and we could put the two of them together, and his money now, I should be to the finest place in the parish. We could have everything, tractor, motor and car, the whole lot, the works. What do you think of that, Neil? I'll go along with you, Jim. Uh, you know, we'll do it. <laughs> <laughs>
daughter from America? I brought you at Christmas, did you not get it? Oh, I did. Well, you're welcome, Rosemary, to these parts. Come on in and sit down. Thank you. Well, after all these years, Rosemary, wish you would you tell me, how's your mother getting on? Jack, she's fine. They're all fine over there. And how are you keeping yourself? You're not good at all, Rosemary. You're the bones of me crippled. But for that old chick, I would be able to get around at all. I had a few weeks vacation coming to me, Jack. I'm staying with the Shines in the village. Will you tell me who runs the farm for you? I have a girl working with me. She's from West Kerry. Nell is her name. On the start, she was the devil to get her out of the bed. But now, she turned out to be a great worker. I'm very pleased with her. Do you remember, Jack, when I was a young lady and used to come here on my holidays? Oh, indeed, Rosemary, I do well. They were the good old times. We had a great crack in the bog and going to the cream rain in the meadow. Ah, oh, sure, they were the times. They were great times, Rosemary. And I used to often say to you, Rosemary, at that time, God, you'll make a great farmer's wife yet. Do you remember that, Rosemary? I remember it. All right, Jack. I suppose it's time now that I should be thinking about settling down and finding a man with a bit of land. Well, Rosemary, since I got you a letter, I have been thinking a lot. Mary next door called, and she mentioned to me that she would I let the land or sell it. And I did a lot of thinking. And what I have thought of, I'm going to make my will and label the place lock, stock and barrel. Well now, Rosemary, what do you say to that? Well, Jack, you're an old dog. So you are to be like long ago again. We'll have a great time and I look after you well. And Rosemary, do you know if I will you ever get a solicitor to call just before we go back? I will, Jack. And I'll, I'll come with him myself and we'll have it all sorted out in a few days. And look now, Rosemary, you get the old kitchen and put down and we'll have a good drop of tea for us together. I will. And Jack, you're an old dude. Right, Rosemary. Wish you, Rosemary. Do you remember the fella you used to be going out with? Did you ever hear? Who's there? It's only Mary, Jack. Since I saw you last. Well, the old bones are the same, Mary, and you're changing. But I never felt better in all my life. And how is Nell getting on with you, Jack? Never better, Mary. The best worker I ever had. No need to call her in the morning. She's up, out, down the fire, milk the cows, and off the first to the cranberry. The best girl that ever I had in all my life. Do you do give any thought to what we spoke about the last day, Jack? About who selling us the land? Well, Mary, I didn't. And the reason I didn't is at the way Neil turned out. I didn't even give it a thought. But if Neil continues on the way she is, I don't think I will sell at all. But in the other hand, if Neil changes, I still have it in the head to sell. Well, I'll be going, so Jack. i see you again. You're always welcome here, Mary. Well, thank God. Any news? Even the what? 
Yok ne içecek diyorsunuz ne o gel? Hayır değil. Neyse ağır kançıda kremli kazı ya. Rumor her zaman bir modern seyir kançıda kremli. Rumor? Var Rumor bu her ne ama? Rumor her zaman kremli de smanın. Seyir vakı de o çekedir. Ay gazi, o latı bir dönüşü o değne o gelin de bilirsin de Rumor. En de seyir kançı bayarın da çoğu bir. Hiç yiyecek diyorsunuz lan da fıfım. Var mı efendim? Ben lazım bir bakayım uçum çek dönüne. I wouldn't mind only I had asked you myself to lease the place to me. Yeah, if I can't ever reply to it. He'd think about it, nothing definite. That's all he'll do, he'll think about it. You won't get nothing off of Jack Dunn, girl, I'm telling you. Umar, how's it now you're thinking of getting married? Jesus, you listen to the whole Umar, girl. Of course, there's a lot you to be set for single life, Jim. Is that? That is, a lot to be set for your own boss and all. I suppose you know all about single life and you married yourself. Well, I had my experience of it. You know nothing, girl, about single life. Single life can get lonely, you know. Get up with you! Come on, come on! 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 Come on, come Hey, that's not the most natural thing I've ever seen. I just have to hold on to that kid. The more that is, man, Jesus. Hey, 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 Hi, Jack. How are you? I brought along Michael Flynn. He's the solicitor from Newcastle West. Good day, sir. And this is Margaret Shine from the shop, from the house that I'm staying in below in the village. Hello, sir. Come in, let here. This is a summary of what took place between John Dunn, John Thomas Dunn and myself. I being a practicing solicitor, Michael Flynn, the square, Newcastle West. I, John Thomas Dunn, of Cool West, at Hay County Limited, being of sound mind, gave all my possessions, lock, stock and battle, and 500 pounds in 100 pound notes to my godchild, Rose Mary Walsh of 10729 South Albany, Chicago, dated on this day, the 4th of the 8th, 1939. Will you sign here, Mr. Dunn, please? Well, now, John Thomas Dunn, you have your work complete. Uh, it is signed here, your signature is here, and the witness is signed, and that completes the whole act. And I must now, I officially stamp that now, Mr. Dunn, and that will complete my business here. Congratulations, Mr. Dunn. Thank you very much. Thank you. And you thank you, Rosemary. And thank you. God bless you now. Jack, you're after giving me more than what I ever expected. And the money. Tell me, Rosemary, how's your mother? I got a telegram last night, Jack. My mother isn't well. She's been taken to hospital, so I'll have to go back, and that's why I got the solicitor on so quickly. Oh, I'm sorry to hear the she's in well, Rosemary. Rosemary, I want to say, okay. we are just happy, Stin. I'd say now, if we got all things stored away, because Neil will be back shortly from the Cranberry and we won't know, won't you know anything about business which went down here this morning. So the quicker we take out the things, the better. Okay, Mr. Dunn. But I'll call again, Jack, before I go back in a couple of days. Do that, Rosemary. Do that.
On her bed is drenched. Kaç almaydı, işi kana altı gider. Ben şu hasta teyabim, sık. Ben de hayır izleyelim. Kaç, kaç işi diyorlar, işi kana altı bilginde kalmadı. Haydi ne yapıyoruz Kanyan? Arpa yarı işi yeti al. Well, you were great, dear lad. To get in, but you take care of your breakfast before you go to the Kremlin. You will have to work. I can't. I was up early this morning. I got up and washed a few clothes and did a few more jobs as well. I make the cows, wash the cows, and all that. So you throw me down in awful lot. Well, you're not going to be selling him. Well, you were great, dear lad. To get in, but you take care of your breakfast before you go to the Kremlin. You will have to work. I can't. I was up early this morning. I got up and washed a few clothes and did a few more jobs as well. I make the cows, wash the cows, and all that. So you throw me down in awful lot. Nearly you went to your breakfast before you got to the cranberry, you were not awful at your work, you. No, I don't need any breakfast. I ate it this morning. I was up early, I told you. Did you have yours? No, oh, Neil, I hadn't any breakfast this morning. I'm not feeling that well, Neil. I'll be paying across that chest there and, and I'll be shot with the bread. Gee, I thought you didn't look well at all. You're all right, Jack. I'll get the doctor for you, Jack. That's what I do. You get me the doctor. Doctor needs I'll be all right. I know you have to have a doctor, Jack, if you're not well. There'll be no doctor come inside the door, Neil. I'll be all right, I tell you. Look, go away to the cranberry. I'm all right. Whatever you say, Jack. I won't be long at the cranberry. I'll be back as soon as I can, to you. I'm going to sell that today, Jim. You know what I never missed the fair night here myself? You got nothing I, I, I was afraid there, Darren. I had to run three rounds of the field today trying to catch you, the bugger. But he's going today, Jim, whatever I get for him. Uh -huh. He's going, I'm not bringing him home. Uh -huh. What did Jack do, sir? She just knows nothing about it. Oh, don't you? He does not, and I don't want him to know. Okay. But sure, you might find a pony for me. Oh, I'll find a pony for what? You will find a pony for what? You should have been better to go out to the fair, would you, sir? Look, I tell what we'll do, look, I tell what we'll do. You hold top there and walk away to Rez. And I'll get the pony that I bought in the store, because I want to show him up to one here today. And I'll get the trap. And the two of us will go in tight here and the pony in trap. And can we bring the with us? Right, Sergeant. Good day, Jack. And how are you keeping? How are you, Mary? I'm not that good at all, Mary. How do you, Jack? That girl. Yes, yeah, yeah, cut off my ass to the fair, in spite of me, and he was here for 20 years. I couldn't stop her. She knows that I wouldn't be able to stop her, and she cut him off in spite of me to send him at the fair. My old rip. Faith, and I'll go down, Jack John, and I'll bring back your ass to you. Make damn sure of that. Will you, Mary? I will indeed. I go and I'll get that nail and I'll bring her and that back to you this very evening, Jack. Well, Jack. Mary, I'll be more than grateful for you. Leave it to me now, Jack. Leave it to me. I'll be back with you as Jack done this very evening. That ripping bitch from Wesh Kerry, the trouble she's have to put me to. Right. 
Hvad er det, de siger, Mike? Hvad er det, de siger, Mike? Hvad er det, de siger, Mike? Oh, <laughs> 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 How much you're asking the heat for the little pig, my lovely Seven lady? Seven and six, sir. Seven and six. Seven and six. Well, a minute. You have a lady down there, sir. Seven and six. Will you take five shillings? No, seven and six. Word, it costs a lot to put him out, sir. I have eight in family now, in all fairness. Four boys and four girls. Well, Come I have ten, one sir. Seven shillings, sir. Seven shillings. No, no, six shillings. Well, seven put it shillings. Up. Six and six. No, seven shillings and we'll check in. A one never got for the seven shillings. Put it out, sir. <laughs> My lovely lady. <laughs> Before the evening is out. I hope I didn't. Can I ask now? You do it, but turn it him up two chairs. You find it for Tony for me. I will. I'll find it for Oh, oh, oh. Ruby, I think it out, sir. I didn't need him. Where do you sit down the stairs? Hello, Mrs. Hello, sir. Bad knowledge. Listen, I want no take for her, no one take less. How much do you take for her? Half a crown, sir. What she's going to do? She's too old. I said, what I do, I give her two cents for her. Isn't that do you? No, I'm not taking two shillings. No, I'd rather take her home. No, no, I can't give you look money. You'll have to give me look. I, I can't. I'm only a servant girl, and I'm working for a main family. farm. I, 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 I can't. I can't give you look money at all. Half a crown now. No, that won't do. I take it home, so <laughs> half a crown. I, I, I give you that. Well, I half a crown. Are you just young servant girl? Indeed, and I am. Just young that's is going home this very minute. Why should I sit and try this? You lend up an old bitch for much. You're the greatest gossip. You go away, mind your own business. Let's go! 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 Let's go!
I'm washing them clothes and he take them off with the hitch. Look at your drawers, look. And he's putting them along with his horns around the muck outside there. I'd have to put them up on the inside line now to dry them. That goat was here for years, Ned. 
evening my father's time. It was lucky to have a goat running with the cows to keep away all the diseases from them. Do you know it's true for you, Jack, about the goat running with the cows? We had goats behind at home too. There was 13 of us. And she, we, we were never sick. We were fine and healthy, I'm telling you. I suppose we were right on the goat's milk. Now, Jack, I've all the jobs done outside. I've the hens fed and the tank washed. And what job do you want me to do next? Neil, will you ever clip the hedge in front of the house? You will get the clippers inside in the church shed, up on the rafter, over the door. Neil, I think I'll go and have a lie down for a while. Right, Jack. I'll call you up for the dinner when it's ready. All right. I'll be just outside then. All right. Oh, jeez, Jack. Are you, are you all right? Jack, what can I do? I'm what can I do, Jack? I'm all right. Then. Help me up to the bed. Do you want some water, Jack? Help me up to the bed. Jack, I'll have to get the doctor. Oh. Come on, Jack. Oh, I fucked you, Jack. Go easy, go easy. Are you all right now, Jack? Oh, I can get an egg on the meat. Oh, what can I do? What can I do? Oh, oh, oh. oh. I'll have to get the doctor now, too, Jack. Oh, I'm not right. No, you won't. I'll have to get the doctor. Give her a light. Take it oh. easy now, Jack. Oh, oh. Can I open the door? Oh. Now, Jack. Oh. of God and this fine day, ma'am. A few pictures here, ma'am, a few statues, ma'am, holy pictures and statues, ma'am. Sacred hat now, ma'am, to protect the house, ma'am, hang it up on the wall and there's a lovely little prayer on the back, ma'am. And uh, child of prayer, ma'am, for the children now, ma'am. For yourself and the boss, ma'am, now, ma'am. Could you say your prayers and protect you in the winter time, ma'am, and if you the statue the whole sacred hat now, ma'am. Go up in the window, ma'am, and pray. Holy water, ma'am, protect you, ma'am, now. Holy water by the door, ma'am. A little picture there now of the sacred hat, ma'am. The holy middle ma'am, would you like holy middle ma'am around your neck ma'am? No, no protect you ma'am, yourself and the boss and the children no, ma'am, pray, pray for you ma'am, pray for you ma'am. I'm only a servant girl here, I've no money, I can't afford it. I couldn't buy anything off for now. Uh, I have a, a few children ma'am now and then the man himself would have dropped in the milk and uh, to the bacon ma'am, would you, would you be able to spare that ma'am now for me ma'am today? I'll see if I can Lord, find. Lord bless you ma'am and spare all the help ma'am, thank you ma'am, thank, right. thank you, thank you, thank you ma'am. The bread and bacon. Lord, spare her the help, ma'am. Lord, spare her the help. And God and bless you, ma'am. God bless you, ma'am. I'll pray for you, ma'am. Are you sure now in Pinterest interested in a few holy pictures? No, no, you, I have no money. I can't afford it. Are you sure, ma'am? No, no, I can't. Thank you, and I'll pray for you, ma'am. Thank you very much. It'll be all right if the man called there for the scrap metal, ma'am. Oh, take it away. I'm sure that's on your own piece of scrap. Lord, you spare her the help, and I'll away. pray for you, ma'am. Thank you very much, ma'am. Lord, bless you now, and God bless you, ma'am. God bless you. Jack? I am, Neil. How do you feel now? I'm feeling a small bit better. Will you have a spot at all? No, Neil, I won't have any dinner today. Are you sure Jack you don't want the doctor? No, there'll be no doctor, Neil. I tell you, I'll be all right. Have a long day at night there, Jack, and you might be better off to get the doctor now. I tell you, I want no doctor. Right, Jack.
You may try once, but anyway, Jack. No, I won't, hate hello. Do you know who I had while I was cutting the hedge? A travelling woman and her man. They were selling, she was selling holy pictures and medals. I'm sure I had no money for them. She was looking for a drop of milk thin for the child, so I gave it to her. And a bit of bread, and a bit of bacon that was there. And I also gave her those scrap that was outside there. What are you saying? Gave her the scrap? She was only outside there turn around. Well, you never go off now, I'm going to get into her again. As fast as you can. Why don't I give you away that clock? Or what do you think? Go off now, I'm going to collect it again from him. But Jack, should I go? Go off I... now, I'm going to collect that straw clock from her. What am I going to do? I have to find Jim now. What am I going to do? Go on, give him away that clock. Jim! Jim! Come here, I'm in an awful way, I want two minutes. What's wrong? Hey, Jim! What's wrong? I'm up to give it away, this crap. And Jack, you're the phone man, this crap. This crap is the woman there. The yard, come on, Jim, I have to get it back. You stopped driving by your friend? That's right, Jim, come on, he's gone. I have a car, the hood is over there. You don't get me wrong, I'll carry no shame. But the Lord made the pudding in the bouquet. When I he was twelve, she said to me, son, Oh, son of age, I plan to be seen. But the pudding is my living, and the road to my home. Oh, you like the program, I think I live, and I think I'll die. For the gold can't be worrying, I'll plain to be young. But the mine of the dingy, I'm proud of my name, and that is... Let the chance Let the chance Wait. Wait a minute. Stop, Jim. Stop and I have a look. Are you the woman I met this morning? This is her, Jim. This is the woman. I am, ma'am. I gave you scrap. Yeah. I wasn't to give you. I gave Sarah, you to the wish machine. Sarah, Lord bless you. Yes, you don't want to get back. We told it for neighbours. I want to get back now. My husband had a metal soul, ma'am. Lord bless you. No, I have to get it back. I couldn't get it. I can't 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 get Oh, 
Shook off anyway, look. They haven't come in at all after us. We didn't shook off. Look, oh. sure, look, we, we, we'll continue on. And sure, look, if he's that bad, he, he, he won't think that. Let us go. Oh, I don't know. One time. There he wants to have up, He won't. He won't. Yeah. Ain't it up? We'll have the last bit anyway from him. The whole lot. Oh, my God. What am I going to say to him? What am I going to do? Oh. Oh, please. Virgin Mary, Jesus, Mary and Joseph, help me, help me, direct me, tell me what to say to him, tell me what to do, oh my God, please, oh, please, if you ever, ever help me, help me now. Yeah. Sorry, I'm sorry, Jack, I didn't get the Lord's scrap for you, I'm sorry. Is that you, Rosemary? What's wrong with you, Jack? Or Rosemary, I will bring him a drink, I asked you. Jack, what's wrong with you? Where is Rosemary? Are you all right? That's you, Rosemary. No, Jack, this is Nell. Oh, Nell, Jack. Who's Nell? Your housekeeper. Who's Rosemary? Rosemary, I'm your housekeeper. Yes, you have, Jack. I'm all alone, Rosemary, and I'm dying. No, I'm here, Jack. You're not dying. You only I'm... fell in the kitchen and I brought you to bed. Rosemary, where's the You're just sick, Jack. Where's the man that was with you, Rosemary? No, there's no one with me, Jack. Oh, Mary. I'll have to get the doctor. You're pulling up, oh, Jack. Oh, I'm on your doctor. You have to loosen your clothes. You're all hot. No, doctor, I'll Rosemary. I'll get some water for you, Jack. Rosemary. Stay Mary. there, Jack, and I'll get some water for you. Rosemary. Look oh. after the land, Rosemary. Oh, Rosemary. Don't you sleep now, newbie? I'm growing a long beard. Oh, You're Mary. You're not, Jack. Well, I'll have to do something with you. It's all down here. A long old whisker. Jack, Rosemary. wait and I show you the mirror, Jack. Look in the mirror. Oh. Hold on a minute, I show you the mirror. Oh, Rosemary. Look, Jack, look at yourself. Oh, oh that you were dead and we went above yesterday together. Jack, oh. that's yourself, Jack. Oh, Dad. That's not your father, Jack. And we'll go tomorrow, Dad, and we'll finish the job. Look, that's yourself and you've grown no beard. Oh, Look at it, Jack. Dad. Oh, Dad. I'm afraid ah. you're raving, Jack. And you're too late to go a beard. Jim. Who tell me the Jack doesn't seem to all run on to the bog? No, I had to come myself, Jim. Then the kid on the tough in the house. I had to come for a handful of tough. Oh, and Jack isn't good at all. Well, what about he today, eh? Oh, he's. 
talking about his father and he sees this. And do you know what he's talking about? He keeps talking about this Rosemary. And this, this man from Newcastle West. He's talking non-stop about him. And he sees his father and his mother and he's gone on. He's doting, he's definitely doting, Jim. He isn't good, sir. He isn't good. He isn't good. A Rosemary. A Rosemary he keeps talking about. I wish I'm talking about his father and mother. Without seeing him. Do you know what, Nan? I'm thinking. If we're going to make any more about all this of a place, now's our time to make it. One more chance. I hope no caught that. I have another smile bit to put above there, look. I do a smile with the rear foot. I cut across the shell coat. I meet who over at Jack Jones' gap. And we'll be in together. Does he want you to meet her? Oh, he won't know you, charge him. He won't know me at all, Peter. He won't know you, Peter. You are on the back of the car. You can do all this. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You trip out. You trip out the car. You trip out the car. One second, huh? Trip out the car. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Oh, Oi, oi. I should laugh a woman to drive into spot like that. Well, Are you any bags in this carrier? Well, I was only a few of them. Hold on to us, hold on to us. There was always a man with us. Very stout, my dear. If you don't feel it up again. Huh? I love it, Nona. I love it, Nona. What's it? What? 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 Oh, thank you, please, God. Look, time is moving on this. And Jack Dunn, could we do that? We better go back and settle up that affair, and we'll come back to the half to look. We'll carry home that. Hold on there now. Do you feel now, Jack? Do you know this man? This is Jim. Do you know me, Jack? I do. I do the man to steal our eggs out from under the hens. And my mother and I said, chase you over the road. And what did you do? You started helping the exactors. Jack, Jack, wake up, Jack. I'm Jim O'Brien, Jack. You're next door neighbor, Jack. I know wake who up. you are. 
Get out of my house, you thief. Get out of my house. He's Jordan, Ned. Ned, he's Jordan. Indeed I am not, when my father is come home from the cremery. He'll give you what's going to you. Get out of my house, you thief. Ned? Ned? You robber, get out of my house. Ned, he's gone. He's not mad. He's doing that. He's doing that. He's doing that. He wants some water. We're going to get you some water, Jack. Yes. What'll I do? Huh? Check his pulse, Joe. Check his pulse. Oh, his pulse is very weak, Jim. I'll have to get a doctor for him. A doctor? Don't mind. No doctor. Doctor, don't you put him into hospital? Oh, Jim, I can't. No. Oh, Jim, look at him. You can't get a doctor. The doctor, if a doctor puts him into hospital, we'll be at all together. Oh, I'll have to do something. Go and get a piece of paper and a pencil, we'll get it. Go on. And we set up our affairs first. Huh? Jack, will you wake up from here? Uh, Jack, can you write? Can you write, Jack? No. My, okay. My father. Has had his What's he say? His father was able to write. He's sensible about his father again. Get him to sign it. Get him to sign the bottom bit. He can make an X. I tired. Do, do. Do, get him to make an X. Do, why? Well, come on, Jack. Write for me. Uh, Hold it, Jack. And I help you? Uh, uh, no, that do, Jim. That'll do fine, that'll do fine. Come on, hey, we'd better send for the priest now. Don't mind your doctor, because the doctor knew how we delayed. Oh, gee, I think we'll have to send for the doctor. Send for the priest. Come on. Oh, Jack, I don't like the look of him at all. He's all right, he's all right. We've the job now. Oh, come on. Nell, Nell, Nell. Nel. What, Jim? Nel. Is he gone? No, 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 no. He, he must have money. Jack, do now, was it money? He must have money, and it's definitely in the house. I know, so but where is he put it? Do a spot money while you're here. No, no, you can search in the huh? back. Search there. Not in here, then. Is it there? No. Nothing. Which one's on the pillar? Oh, mine teams. Mine teams. Hi, hi. Oh, Jim. What did you Oh, shh. Please. Hold that. Hold that. Here, here. Hold that. Hold that. Oh, I don't know, Jim. Give me the piece of paper and I'll write the wheel. Yes. Oh, I don't think it's right, Jim. Don't. Oh. Why would it be right? Oh. I don't know. Why would it be right? If we don't do it, someone else will do it. Oh, he works so hard for it. He did the man, bloody miser. Oh, poor Jack. Poor Jack, my, 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 my. Oh, I don't know, Jim, is it right? Hey, stop. Listen now, oh, listen to this now. Listen to this. Oh. I, Jack Dunn, of Old West, I tell you, they're all that I have to Ned Murphy, oh. who is Dingle County Kerry. Sign. Oh. And him with his ex here. So look, the man knew no better than to sign an ex. In oh, the I perfect. don't think it's right, Jim. So I how don't could it be wrong? Oh. If we don't do it, look, Ned, someone else do it. Look at all the money here. Look, I'm better dated. I'm better dated. And he works so hard for it. What day are we today? The 15th of the 16th, I don't know. The 16th. Sixteenth. Oh, oh, Jack. Of September. I got to like him in the engine. Nineteen. Cut there. Nine. No. All signed, sealed, and delivered. Everything all wrapped up and ready for order. Oh, I don't know, Jim. Look, I said what we'll do. Look. We'll count the money now, right? I don't go away then. Look, listen to me. We'll count the money and you can go away then and put your mind in there and send for the police for him. We'll count the money first now and we'll send for the priest in. All right? Jesus, Ned, Ned, put it away, honey. Put it away. Put it away. Who's that? Who's that? Come on, come on, come in, come in. Come in! There's something wrong. I have poor Jack doing it a bad fall. <laughs> Jack is... Jack is very weak. In the British holiday. You won't oh, make the man. night. I was just going for the priest. Oh, poor man. <laughs> you want to come up to see him? I would, of course, yeah. Oh, poor oh, Jack. Oh, poor man. Very well, you know, he might not even be able to talk to him. Oh, the poor oh. man. Oh, Jack, what we are of?
you want one? Come back. Want one? No. call in the village. Okay, Hello. Father. Thank you, Father, for coming. Thank you. Jack is very weak. He's not well at all. Are you all right? Do you want some Listen. water? No, I'll sit down a minute. Okay. I hope you're up there, Chair. Or maybe you would like to see him. Would you like I to walk me see, see him? Jack? Okay, I'll help you up. Walk the door there. Didn't I say I'd come back and I'd look after you? Yeah. Oh, he's not gone, is he? Oh, he's not. Jack? Oh, Jack, he's not. He's gone yet, is he? Can't find any pulse. No, oh, I think he's Jack. gone. Oh, poor Jack. And he was so good and kind to me. And he did me And all he gave me. Oh, Jack. Oh, Father, what in heaven? Nobody had name that can be called. Maybe do me like this, too. Spare the bread and forgive us our trespasses. Don't leave us now. 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 Did you get the medal back from the village? He did the poor man. Yeah, but he was away. I couldn't let all his labor out. And of course the years were there. The years, the father, the father finished him out. The father finished him out. And we have to let him all tangled by the princess. We fell out and we fell in. They got rid of it. The decent man he was, too, than Jack. Yeah, he was a decent man. Just, he didn't have all that he had to let him. He didn't have to let him. Oh, he did. He left me the farm. Yeah, lock, shock, and battle, land. Oh, Jake. She was dead up here. What are you talking about? Jack. Jack left everything to me. He did not. He did. He did not. You look there. Look and see him there. Will you look? He couldn't have. He left me the car. Let me see your will. Well, that is look. Say you need eggs in the bottom bit. Jack was well able to write. And I have the proper will. Jack left everything to me. And his cash and everything. He left me the car. There's his signature. I would have for that and he left me the bar my pen and he left it to me. Rosemary has everything here. I thought he couldn't write. How did I know you memorized me? You just went to the He left the child. He left me everything. He did not. He did. He left everything with me. 
Here's a show you can me and then to leave. How can I know? He left me everything. I, I deserved it. I want you to know what I did. You want to me? You'll never get back in here. Go, 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 go. Well, Mary, should I report those criminals to the police? I don't know, girl. But then again, it would be great to see that bitch from West Kerry in Abdurna. Jack thought highly of her, and she could be your neighbour yet. He did. She could be my neighbour yet. And I'll tell you, she'd have all the more respect for me after the hiding we're after giving her. They were meant for each other, the two of them. They were. But they needed all their strength and cutting to get him through the hard times ahead of him. Jack always spoke of the hard times. He did hard times. But I suppose for now, Rosemary, we'll have to let bygones be bygones. Jim! Jim, wait for me! Come on. Wait for me! We shouldn't have gone near interfered with that will, Jim. It's all awful about the will. It's all awful about Jack Dunn. It's all awful about any one of them. Oh. Look, that yank, look. Do you think she's going to stay around here in that parcel of land? I don't hope in the name of God. She'll have that for sale in a year or two. And the other man that's going to buy it? The man that's going to buy it is Jim O'Brien. You're looking at him here. Because he's a smarter man than anyone thinks in that here. Do you I, hear me? I know, but what am I going to do now, Jim? I've not to show for six months with Jack Dunn. I've no wages and I'll have to go back to Wish Kerry. I've no place to go now. Look, no, it's all right. While Jack Dunn was making peace with his maker, I was making peace with his pocket. I have his, I, I, I have his, I have his watch here, look. And if you were bothered with it, I know I won't know nothing about it. You didn't, Jim. I did. I'm saying nothing to no one about it now. You hear me? I don't know, Jim. I'll have, to, I'll have to go back. I've no place to go. Where am I going to stay? Go back where? Where's Carrier? Should I have to go back home? Well, look. So I came here for a job, look, and now look, I'm... Look, 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 look. There's a horse above there, look, in the hill. There's no one there for the question. Half a street is standing. They don't want to come up and join me. You even mean it, Jim? You mean it? I wouldn't care if I didn't mean it. Well, look who is there. I don't care. Come on. We can get married next week. Let's be married, huh? Come on, 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 Come on,
Ja, waarom de Holland? Bravo, Joe, Bravo, Joe, Bravo. 